Hey guys, it's Skuzzy and welcome to another Monday's Journey. Uh, today is Monday and I just uploaded a video. I hope you guys watched it. It's my first 1 to 99 guide. Um, but here I am on the Halloween, or not the Halloween, what am I talking about? On the uh, RuneScape homepage uh, in the news section and it's talking about the Halloween event that they came out with today. Uh, let's just read it. Become the evil laboratory assistant that you've always dreamt of being in this free-to-play, repeatable Halloween event. Join Dr. Frankenbrain for four D&D-type events as you help create a monster. Then explore the outskirts of a darkened Falador as you gather the parts to make your very own mechanical pet. Find out all the details in this news post along with uh, any other announcements and stream info. Okay, so the requirements, there are not any, and it is entirely free to play, which is pretty cool. Um, there are no special stat requirements or gear, but there might be complications, so bring a little food. Uh, bringing a little food might be a good idea. Okay. Um, head to a new portal outside the Invention Guild northeast of Falador and zip through dark to Dark Falador. Interesting. Um, meet up with your old pal, Dark Dr. Frankenbrain on the other side of the Halloween portal and talk to him to begin. Lend the doc a hand and probably a few more body parts to boot as you work to create a replacement for his failed zombies. There are four activities to take part in every day. Body part sorting. Ugh, that sounds weird. Driving a conveyor belt with a bicycle. Uh, divine entanglement and generator charging. The doc assures us that any deaths that may incur will be safe ones. So have fun. Uh, rewards help build a uh, like, yeah, gray matter that you can use to buy Halloween themed events. Uh, rewards, sorry, these include a lightning rod hat, creep plast, creeptastic pet, and mad professor title. Um, okay, mechanical spider pet hunt. Pet hunt. When you're done, explore the outside area of Frankenbrain's lab to locate eight pieces of the mechanical spider pet. Assemble them and you'll be able to purchase the pet in the event's reward, reward shop. This event will run for two weeks until the update on November 7th. Okay. And then there's live streams. Other news. Elite skilling outfits update. In case you have not seen it, be sure to head over to the forums for an update post on skilling elite, uh, elite skilling outfits and how they work. Uh, I did look at that uh, a little bit earlier today. It was something posted on Twitter. Win a life-size golden scythe. Oh, yeah, I got my 1 million fire runes. Awesome. Now I'll never run out. Like I did at Telos that one time and ruined my, like, 11 streak, which sucked so bad. But, uh, yeah. So we're going to go do the event and bring some rock tails. So to start the event, you just go to this portal that's near the Invention Guild and enter the Dimension Portal. And it should take you to Dark Valador. I think that's what it's called. So it's kind of like the Dimension of Disaster. Okay, so he needs help inside the Invention Guild. Pretty much. Interesting. Uh, hey, thanks for coming. We really need your help. At least Dark and Frank, Dr. Frankenbrain here needs it so he can finish his current project. And the MDF needs his work in order to survive. Okay, so... I literally have... I don't know what, what, what I'm doing. I don't know what to do. There's a bunch of people in this room doing like a merry-go-round thing. Oh, this is the running. Okay. Um, hmm. Oh, there's a thing here that I need to talk to. What is this, Iron Doc? We do not need outsiders. My work shall produce results. This outsider is here to keep you in check, Doctor. Your methods have been growing increasingly worrisome. I'm still not sure how you convinced us to lend your aid to this cause. My methods are not only uh, as are only as dark as is required to defeat the enemies we face. Uh, what have you got me into, Iron Doc? I thought this was just here to help, blah, blah, blah. These are not the dwarves you're looking for. Ha, trying to use your, okay. I don't really want to read all of this. So 
So once you talk to him, you can start uh, doing this stuff. I don't know what the hell is going on here. I'm just tossing some heads into the bin. That's freaking disgusting, dude. That, oh my god. That's disgusting. Wow. What am I even doing with my life? <laughs> So just from what I've gathered, um, basically you want to toss the correct bin that has the light over it, and it'll give you 4% parts disassembled each time. Honestly, i assuming that you get up to 100% and then you can move on, but I don't know. I'll uh, let you know when I find it. Okay, so I just got 50 gray matter for doing that, um, and then it reset to zero. So let me check out maybe one of the other rooms. The second one seems a little more AFK. Um, it shows you the correct speed is at fast right now. So I'm at fast, so that's the correct speed. And I'm just AFKing here. I think it's pretty funny that uh, neither one of these gears are moving on these bikes, but they're pedaling. <laughs> um, that's something they might need to fix in the code unless didn't really care about what other people see. Um, but yeah, I would fix that if I was, you know, coding or whatever. I don't know if it's, I mean, I'm assuming it's possible to do. It's just probably a variable with um, the person who's actually riding it or like this is an instance itself or something and it won't show that. But like if I, maybe if I got off of it, I would show it, I don't know. Oh, I'm doing the wrong thing anyways. Whoops. So for this room, uh, from what I'm understanding, um, you open the valves and then it'll let you know if a valve closes or something or if the pressure needs to be released and then you uh, will release it. The chaotic energy needs depressurizing, yeah. So pressurize, uh, depressurize the chaotic vat. So that's that one and then the, the divine blend progress will go up to 100% and it seems like you'll get 50 more of those um, what are those things called 50 gray matters or gray matter I guess so yeah so this one I think is the one where it's at it may be a little bit slower actually I don't know if it's slower but it is definitely AFK all I have to do is uh, go on the inside track and then just wait it out. So, yeah, I feel like this one is the one that most people are going to be doing. I mean, everybody is here um, just doing it. So, yeah, uh, I think that about sums it up. I'll come back in a little bit when I have enough uh, pieces to get my completion escape back uh, and my trim completion escape back. Oh, and I'm not 100% sure, but I think you have to do the rooms in order. So uh, going uh, clockwise, and this one is the last one. That's why it's the best one to do or, well, the most appealing to do. Uh, so, yeah. So I just bought the Mad Professor title and the Lightning Rod hat. It wouldn't let me go back in for some reason. I think you got to do... I think you got to do them all over again, which is kind of annoying actually but uh what's gonna be done here what the hell what the hell is this <laughs> he just put a bunch of different runescape gods together wow wow that's Is he going to kill me? I'm waiting. Oh, yeah. I can't attack him. Can I? My goodness. No, I'm going to leave here. I can't attack him. Lol. Okay, apparently I got to click on the, the lights when they zap. So hopefully I can get through this uh, and not die. But uh, no promises. We'll see. Can't really use abilities because I'm in a free-to-play world, but 
Come on, hurry up. I don't want to hear this again. I just heard this. Do not kill me. Oh, missed me, missed me. Missed me. Oh, missed me again. Grab that one. Oh, missed me, missed me. Yeah, buddy. Hell yeah. Grab that one. Hell yeah. Zap, 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 zap. Got him. Ah, this ain't that bad, actually. Just make sure you uh, don't get hit by his, his wind. So all I got to do is keep running, pretty much. And then just grab a zapper. Yeah, that's not too bad. Just pretty much run in a circle. <clears throat> not too bad, not too bad. Oh, this is going to take a while, though. Uh, I got to avoid that one. Yeah, I'll come back when he's lower health. Okay, so he's doing a thing over there that I can't do. And he's exploding, so this is bad. Okay. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Oh, those go away after a little bit. Okay. Cool. It's pretty much just going to make sure I don't run into him. It's fine. Pretty close to being done. I'm pretty close to being done. Well, I have two more of these. Boom. Is that it? Nice. 50 gray matter for that. So weird. So weird. I mean, I think I'm done with that. Cool. So, I don't know. I guess you got to do them in order. Is he going to make another one? Of course, I have been given a job, and I shall see it through. This mountain will not be safe until his... Wow, this invention lock isn't a perfect science, so the last guardian may have, well... Um, the last guardian may have been useful, have been less useful than a giant cat eagle thing, but the next one will be perfect. From this point onwards, I shall begin a new experiment each day. If you help me complete all five stages of each new day, um, you shall earn gray matter more efficiently. You're free to repeat any of the four preparations as often as you desire. However, you will receive less gray matter in doing so. Oh, okay. Um, can I please go and just AFK this? Yay. Yay. And there is my trim back. Awesome. That wasn't that too, it wasn't too hard to do that. I'm going to do it for a little bit more just to gain some uh, gray matter, get the rewards and stuff. But yeah, so thanks guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you have a great day. Follow me on social media and subscribe for more. Peace.